Hello there, my beautiful collective. I hope you're having a wonderful day. What's going on, collective? This reading, how are you showing up to people? What's the energy you're presenting, right? What's the energy you're presenting? Some of you are definitely holding back your emotions. You're probably being very mindful of what you're giving to. I had a damn thing wrong with that. <sighs> so, okay, that wants to stay put. So here we go. Yeah, you got a lot of love, but you know, you're very mindful of who gets the opportunity to tap into that. Someone sees you happy. People see you're happy. You're in a good disposition. I think you're in a good energy, right? You don't have to toot your own horn because you know what? That's just tacky and uh, yeah, you don't have to, right? Uh, you let your work speak for itself. You let you speak for yourself, right? You don't have to say shit. Ooh, your light agitates. So a lot of you. The negative energy around, it's agitating. So, happy disposition, right? You look at things positive. Mm. Some of you probably got a little saying or a little scripture you say to people who's going through something. I'll pray for you. You're going to be okay. 133 on the phone. Um, I like that. So... I don't think you're in much negative energy because you're, you're light... Uh, it confounds the wicked, right? Ooh, yeah, you got a lot of little wisdoms, little words, little sayings, whatever. You're just full of happiness and sunshine here. You're in a good energy space. I like that. A lot of you, you've done the healing. You've done the healing. Eight of Swords. You're very mindful. You will put somebody in time out. You don't fuck around with shit. You're in that light. You're staying in that positive light. Put a person in time out. <laughs> <laughs> oh, but you send them on their way with a nice little blessing. Maybe a maybe a little gift basket or something. You're in a good energy. Uh, I love that. Four of cups. I don't feel like you're really... Yeah, you got a close knit circle. You're not, uh, you're not open for invites right now. Uh, so you're probably turning a lot of people down. You're probably turning a lot of people down. You got good guidance here. You got, you got a good God, uh, GPS system, right? God protective system, guidance system, however you want to put it. You want some good shit. You're on some good energy. Mm. Yeah, you, you put people in time out. You don't fuck with them. You're probably a one shot and you're out type person. You're not fucking around. You're not fucking around. Uh-uh, you'll walk away. Yeah, you're like retrograde energy. You're like retrograde energy. Okay. But that's what keeps you in that happy disposition. You're very mindful of what you tap into, who you're around. Yeah, you're manifesting something. That's why you're keeping your circle tight. Ace of Cups, the Chariot Energy, the Libra Energy, and the Three of Cups. Oh, my Lord. Oh, my Lord. Oh, my Lord. What the fuck even is this? Six of Pentacles, Seven of Pentacles, Knight of Wands, Page of Wands, to the Ten of Cups. Oh, this is like bless your heart energy. Oh, Lord have mercy. Someone tried to piss on your parade, piss in your teapot or some shit. That shit's being returned to sender. Lord have mercy. you got a good guidance system. You're definitely very mindful of uh, what you partake in. Archangel Michael energy here. Ooh. You put people, places, and time out. That three of swords energy. 
That's the whole fucking point here. You're focusing on the good, the positive. Six of Pentacles, Seven of Pentacles, Knight of Wands, Page of Wands to the Ten of Cups. Uh, your peace, love, and light. You ain't fucking at this negative energy. Uh, -uh. you put a bitch in time out. You send them. You send them packing. Some of you are turning down uh, invitations and offers. Uh, you're not even doing anything just to be socially polite. You're like, no, nah, I'm full. You're focusing on something else. Damn, look at that. Why does it feel like once you kind of set... Uh, you, that's like the, the sand, right? You do the line in the sand. And it's, it's, it's causing a stir. So if you were in a, a bad energy or you were sort of feeling down and out and, you know, things weren't going so great, you kind of changed your disposition. And now you're focusing on the positive. You're focusing more on the positive than the negative. That's the whole fucking point. If you're in the Nine of Swords, you like flip that light switch on. The sun will come out tomorrow. Well, guess what, bitch? It's tomorrow. You're in a good energy. Confounds the wicked. But yeah, you're putting people... People, places, things, and time out. You're not given to just anything and everything. Uh, you ain't the social butterfly. Feels like you had some, some fuck shit energy around you any damn way. Right? But this feels more like a bless your heart type send off. Uh, you're just not accepting the invite. You're not accepting the invite. It's only good. It's only good energy for you. Because it's like you turn the light switch on. So if you're in that Nine of Swords energy, you're not in that energy anymore. You flipped the switch. Confounds the wicked, right? You went deep. People are seeing you're in a good disposition. And that's fucking with that negative energy. Y'all know the devil will get in like a cockroach, right? So you got to be in the light, facing your fears, focusing on you, uh, deciding what you're given to, what you're not given to, putting people, places, and things in time out. You're not given to it. But also don't feel like you're really open for invites either. You're like top shelf energy right here. It's top shelf energy for you. <sighs> I feel like you put in the time, energy, and effort. And now that's starting to pay off in more ways than you can imagine. Instead of just seeing the rain, you're seeing the rainbow. Instead of focusing on the negative, you're looking towards the positive. You've had a change of energy right here. The devil can only come in if you invite that energy in. Uh, some of y'all, you using diatomaceous earth? That's the best thing to get rid of insects, right? It's like silica. It's like minute glass particles. Dehydrates the bugs. So you're like really focusing. You're not tapping in the negative energies. But you're also not making a big fucking deal about it. This is just politely declining the invite. You're only focusing on the good. That's how you're showing up to people. So whatever negative energies around you, hmm, your light kind of prevents that. Your positivity prevents that, right? This is being mindful of what you partake in. Put good in, get good out. So you're probably even changing up the, the shows that you watch, the music that you listen to. Everything is positive. My God, look at all that energy. You flip something the fuck around and look at that.
Put a little Jesus in it. Why does that page of cups feel like a bless your heart type energy? Ooh, as my light goes out. Sweet Jesus. Okay. I love that. Oh, I think you can actually see the cards better, huh? Look at that temperance angel. You are definitely focusing on you. I don't think you're given to others. You're not given to others. It's top shelf for you. Some of you are just breaking free from like a traditional sort of mindset here. It, I do feel you have a spiritual sort of relationship going on here. Spirit is casting out the toxic uh, people, places, and things you don't need. Some of it could just be beliefs, uh, to be quite honest with you. Page of Wands, yeah. Three of Swords, Three of Cups, this uh, Libra energy. Um, you're not really doing anything, uh, but it's breaking people's hearts. Five of Swords, Six of Swords, to the Chariot, to the Ace of Cups. You're choosing you. You're choosing you. Overabundant. You know, that's almost like sprinkling holy water on the freaking uh, 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 vampire, right? You are confounding the wicked. You're changing things up. But this does feel like a singular energy. This is like breaking uh, familial ties, familial connections. You're like on your own fucking course here. And you're being very polite about it, which is absolutely beautiful. But it feels like bless your heart energy. Like there, there's no conflict here. There's, there's nothing. Uh, you're just letting your silence, your love, your happiness for yourself is breaking, breaking others' hearts. You do have some toxic energies around you. Now, that doesn't have to be people. That could just be thought processes, um, a group dynamic. This feels more like your personal life. You're happy and optimistic. You, you were able to turn the light on. Whatever scared you or worried you, you flipped the switch. You're not scared of the dark, right? You're not scared of the dark. Now you're seeing possibilities. Ace of Cups, the Sun, to the Ten of Cups. Babies, you're focused on you. It's all about you. Moving forward in positive energy. So, you know, how people see you, they see you're breaking free. I do feel like you got some sort of spiritual guidance here. Maybe some of you are changing up your religious preferences that might have been in, ingrained in you. And that page of cups really just feels like, bless your heart. I don't see no conflict here. So you're not creating any conflict. Your light just confounds the wicked here. 1333 on the phone when I said that. <sighs> Casting out the negative and letting the good in. So maybe some of y'all, maybe you got baptized again. Maybe you're thinking about getting baptized. Maybe you just found religion. You found happiness. Uh, yeah, you found love in a hopeless place. You found love in a hopeless place. And that's usually when spirit reaches out and grabs you when you're in the dark. So some of y'all got on your knees and prayed. And man, that spirit working on your behalf to confound the wicked. You breaking some major ties here, connections. So that's going to be a little rough. But what the fuck? You're showing up good. So obviously the work's done good. It's been to your benefit. That feels like bless your heart energy. You're not doing or saying anything. This is, uh, this, you're not about the conflict. Someone don't like that. You flip the light switch on that nine of swords. Anything else for the collective? How are people viewing the collective right now?
as the winner. But, you know, moving forward, good opportunities, happiness, sunshine, riding off into the sunset, happy, protected. My God, you got a lot of protective energy around you. Yes, you do. But you are leaving people, places, and things behind. Yes, yeah, it's gonna go be happy. You're gonna be happy. This is the kind of the trail, right? Eat my dust type energy there. <sighs> Confounding the wicked energy. You broke free from something. Some of you, I think it's just your own thought process. Now you're happy as fuck. Chasing your dreams. You got good spiritual guidance along the way. Archangel Michael. Five of Swords is good problem solving energy as well. Because you got the Six of Swords. You got a good guidance system here. Whatever the fuck you're using. It's working on your behalf. Riding off into the sunset. Happy as a pig in shit. Mm-hmm. So... Stay tapped into that energy, right? It's kind of even like a bar graph. You can see how it goes up. Uh, your energy gets stronger. So keep moving in a good direction. It's to your benefit. Whew. Peace, love, and light.